In this video, we are going to talk about the chord angle theorem. So first of all, let's make sure you know what a chord is. So a chord is a line segment that connects on the endpoints of a circle, like you can see pictured here. The chord does not necessarily have to go through the center of a circle. It's just a line segment that goes across the circle. So if you have two chords in a circle that intersect each other and they form an angle, the way that you can calculate that angle is to add the two intercepting arcs together. So here we're talking about this arc A along with this arc B. We're going to add those two arcs together and then divide by two. You're basically just taking the average of them. So if we look at this specific example, now we know how big these two arcs are. We've got this arc here that's 40, and then we've got this other arc here that's 110. So all we need to do is add those two arcs together and then divide by 2. So 40 plus 110 is 150, and if we divide that by 2, we're going to get our answer of 75. So all you need to do is add the two arcs together and then divide by 2. If you needed to figure out the angle that is right next to theta, so say you were trying to figure out this angle instead, just keep in mind that we've got straight lines here. So since we've got straight lines, we know that those two angles are going to add up to be 180, which means that if we do 180 and we subtract 75, we can figure out how big that other angle is. So in this case, it would be 105.